Just 24 hours after we reported that a razor blade had been embedded on a playground slide, another blade has been found in Huntsville. This time it was from a utility knife and it was attached to a shopping cart at a Target store off I-45 and Smither Drive. Channel 2's Jonathan Martinez has been speaking with concerned shoppers and joins us live from there now. Jonathan, do police think these cases might be connected? You know, Bill, tonight police just aren't sure about that, but that is certainly something that they are looking into. Needless to say, though, with these very dangerous discoveries happening with just 24 hours apart, exactly. there are a lot of people out here who are pretty worried. While shopping went on as normal at this Huntsville Target, many people still shaken after the recent discovery at this shopping center. Police say they were called out after a utility knife blade was found attached to a shopping cart. I don't understand why somebody would want to do something like that. It is scary, sure. I mean, what else do we have to worry about? Like, oh my goodness. The blade was found after a customer hurt themselves on it, but only suffered minor injuries. Police say no other tampered carts were found, and they're now working with the store to track down a suspect. It's scary, <laughs> you know, that you can't even go shopping without worrying about something like that. Even more frightening, the latest blade find comes just one day after a razor blade was found melted into playground equipment not too far down the road at Emancipation Park in Batcher Mill Park. The way the world is, it's just, you know, I just, I, I don't know what's wrong with people, you know, to do something like that. Police say it's unclear if the blade found in the park and most recently at the shopping center are connected, but they're asking the public to stay vigilant and report any suspicious activity or call if they know anything about either case. I definitely looked before I took a hold of my shopping basket, but that's just sad that you have to stop and think about things like that. And tonight, Target did release a statement about that matter, reading in part, quote, as soon as our store team learned of this incident, we immediately assisted the guests. We are partnering with local law enforcement and have shared our surveillance video to assist in that investigation. Additionally, we are checking all carts at our Houston area stores to ensure that they are safe for our guests. We are reporting live tonight from Huntsville. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Jonathan, thank you. This is not the first time we've reported on blades being found on shopping carts. You may recall last Friday, we told you about a woman in Missouri who was disinfecting her shopping cart at a Walmart when she felt a razor blade. Police say in that instant, it may not have been intentional and that shoplifters used these blades to cut the tags off items or open packages. You can read more about these incidents on clicktohouston.com. Just look for Jonathan's story on our homepage.